Hey guys, it's Christina Cimarelli. You probably know me from my main channel, Cimarelli, which is the band I'm in with my sisters. And this is my second channel. On this channel, I make videos about pregnancy, eventually motherhood, motivational, inspirational stuff, marriage, and life advice. And today, we have a special guest. What's your name? Hey, I'm Nick, I'm Christina's husband. This is my husband, and we've been together for 10 years. And we've been married since 2018. So we're gonna do the husband tag today. Do you know what that is? Nope. I told you what it was. Yeah, you described it to me earlier, but I still don't really know exactly what you gotta it is. Try to speak up. <laughs> and uh, basically, I was gonna ask questions and you're gonna answer them. We're gonna see how well you know me. Okay. <laughs> so let's... Let's begin. Let's begin. <laughs> okay. With that first question. All right. First question. How long have we been married? So since October 2018, so we're at like one year, five months, six months. Not six months. But yeah, close enough. Okay. Yeah. How and where did we meet? Um, so back when we were living in Northern California, you met my sister in a class in school. And then somehow that turned into me and you talking on Facebook. And then I met you in person for the first time on Christmas Eve, 2009, when I drove up to your house. True, very true. Um, where was our first date? Uh, movie theaters in Eldorado Hills. It was our first like official going out date. Yes, that was good. That was a good date, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, Watching right? a movie about <laughs> blue people. Um, what's it called? Avatar. Avatar, yeah, that's right. Um, didn't you fall asleep or I fell asleep or something? I think you fell asleep. Yeah, I was not that entertained. Okay, where was our first kiss and how was it? Uh, it was after the movie, was it not? It was? Yeah, it was after the movie when I was dropping you off at home. And how was it? It was good. It was a good first kiss, <laughs> I'd say. 10 out of 10. <laughs> 10 out of 10, okay. When did you meet my family? Uh, well, some of them I met on Christmas Eve when I came over for the first time. Um, just a few people. No, and that then... was just Michael. He came up. You were up. up oh, yeah. I thought For some reason, I thought there was others. And then came over to your house sometime after. I can't remember exactly when, but I want to say it was probably like first or second week of January maybe I came over and actually met people. Right away. He was yeah, like, was why don't quick. I, he, he suggested, why don't I just come in and meet your family? And I was like, what? I never had a guy yeah. be like, can I meet your family? Normally they're like, opposite. Yeah. Came into the house. I think I actually had dinner with you guys once too. Yeah, you did. It's all family. Um, when and why did you fall in love with me? <laughs> um, I think just over time from getting to know you more, hanging out. When? Um, Immediately. The when, yeah, it was pretty quick. It was like by, so we met in December. It was kind of like by the end of February, March, I want to say. Yeah. And why? I answered the why before. No, you didn't. What yeah, was the why? It was just hanging out with each other and getting to know each other more. And then I was like, wow, she could be the one. <laughs> okay. Ah, my hair's too long for that. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> no, it's okay. Um, what do you two do for a living? Oh my gosh. Our neighbor is like weed whacking really loudly, but okay. What do you two, let's speak up more. What do you two do for a living and are you using your college degree? Are you going first or am I going first? You can go. Um, I work in construction, so we do commercial buildings. Um, and my degree is in construction management and engineering, so. You used to? Yes. Okay, I don't have a college degree. <laughs> I'm a college dropout, but I would have gotten one in music at the time, but then later it would have been psychology and I'm using both in my job, so. Yeah, I didn't get a degree, it doesn't really matter. Okay, what do you love most about me? There's never a dull moment. It's always something <laughs> random going on, whether it's Oh my god. Drama or a new activity or a goal. Drama? Yeah, you love the drama. No, I don't. I don't. Not real drama. Yeah, okay. 
I don't. <laughs> what is my favorite color? Um, I don't think you have a specific favorite color. If I had to pick one, I'd probably say pink, but then you also love like all these different colors that like what? come over time. Gray, for instance, you're like, obsessed <laughs> with gray. Gray and like creams and stuff like that. And Neutrals, you're right. He's exactly right. That was perfect answer. What is my favorite food? Mm, changes, mm. but I mean, right now it's like cereal. It's like, <laughs> Well, that's like the pregnancy favorite yeah. food. Um, well, like your all-time favorite, I guess would be... Probably not. You know one of my favorite meals that we've been getting recently? I don't know if you can think of it. But I'm like, this is my favorite meal. That we've been getting recently? Yeah, we have. Oh, like tzatzikis and stuff? Yeah. Like, oh, okay. Chicken gyro. Mm, yeah. Really good. good. Um, oh, I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. What is my favorite TV show? Mm, I feel like that also changes. I mean, everybody's favorite TV show's gotta change at some point, right? But I mean, like right now you're watching The Arrow, which is really good, but then yep. you also watch That's these random really like rom-com type TV shows that, you know the one where they like get engaged and they haven't even met each other? I don't oh know my stuff. gosh! You watch all sorts of random stuff. But so my very favorite, taste in my, TV shows. I think my favorite shows are shows that you have showed me, which is yeah. really weird. Cause I didn't really trust that anything you liked I would like, but I oh my gosh, ones. they're so loud. And I don't, I don't want to edit this video, so we're just gonna keep going. What is my favorite sports team? Hmm. Whatever I'm rooting for. I don't give a rip. Or sometimes whatever I'm not rooting for. So or like the underdog or the opposite of what I pick, depending what? on. The I've never done them. that before. Yeah, yeah. I do not care about um, sports teams. Um, I like sports, but just not that professional sports. What is my favorite type of sandwich? You're not a big sandwich person. I used to be a huge sandwich person. Um, I I places. love sandwiches though. Yeah, I'm trying to think of what you get. Like you, a lot of times I feel like you do like clubs and stuff when we go places. Or you you do like chicken flatbread or um, ah! stuff like that. Mostly like chicken type sandwiches. You're not really a deli meat kind of person. I like the times. Italian meats. Yeah, okay. And chicken, yeah, you're right. Fair. Okay, what is something I do that you wish I wouldn't do? <laughs> what a trick question. It's not a trick question. Um, leave doors and drawers open. What doors? Like the cabinets and stuff. I swear I almost. Oh, my actually, head this or my happens shins, a lot. Like five, ten, I like to ten leave them open day. until I've done everything with them and then close them at the Which very is end. like four months from now because you just you got to come back at some point. Right? Oh well, okay, that's not that bad. Who is my best friend? Another tough one for you, because I feel like your sister's is like the default answer. So you're closest with that. Yeah, but that's then a good answer. after then, you have a lot of friends that are like you have some distant friends that you still remain close with, even though you haven't talked to them in a while. Um, then there's like people here that you're close with. I don't know how. Who you, do I hang out with the most here? Um, probably like Kira and. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, probably Kira's the closest here. I think. Um, what is my heritage? I don't even know my heritage that much. What go. is my heritage and where am I from? Kind of. Italian, uh, Irish. Big one that you have. German. Oh, German. <laughs> you only have like Lithuanian, three. Czech. No, no, no. Uh, Those are Polish, not. Polish, Russian. That's not actually what I am. <laughs> A bunch more stuff. A bunch of European stuff. Um, what's my favorite type of cake? Interesting question. I guess. You have been around me eating a lot of cake. That's a I feel like you just don't say no to cake, so. I mean, I don't, I'm not obsessed with cake, but if there's ice cream, then I definitely Isn't want there it. literally a flavor called birthday cake? Yeah, birthday cake ice cream. Oh, really good. That's ice cream, that's right. What do I do when I'm eating cake? Shovel? No, yes, but <laughs> no. Um, I eat really fast. He eats really fast too. Um, what do I do with the cake? I always do something, I don't think you ever see me do it, but you'd think you would after 10 years. You probably scrape some frosting off. Yes, you're right, always. Okay, so now the questions random, randomly changes to each other. What are some weird habits of each other? 
Weird habits? Just random weird habits? Just general? Yeah. What are some weird habits that you have? I have to think of that. I really uh, wish we hadn't filmed this right when that's going on, but I don't want to redo it. Gosh dang. Okay. What are some weird habits of each other? Can you think of any? Not really. Um, Can you think of anything weird I do? That's good. I think I do have weird stuff. What are some weird habits? I can't I really think of anything weird. All your weird habits are probably just normal to me now. If you had asked me like five years ago, I probably could have given you a list, but. Okay. Now I'm just used to it. I don't know if he has any weird habits. Um, what is a unique talent that I have? You land like a cat every time you fall. <laughs> Wait, is that, have you heard me say that or did you just say that out of nowhere? No, I've, we've talked about this before. Okay. But it is a unique talent, right? Thank you. That is true. What do you, what do we argue about the most? I don't know why it says you. Scheduling. Yeah, like not being able to see each other enough. Mm. Yeah, when stuff's going on, something changes, there's a wrench in the plans or miscommunications. That's probably the most common. Yeah. Who was the first person to say I love you? Me. Oh, it was so cute. What is your, I think it's supposed to be mine. I don't know why I'd randomly go to your. What is my most repeated phrase or sentence? Rip. Yeah, I do say that all the time. Yeah, that's definitely the current phrase that all the kids are saying. True. Anyway, it's not the current phrase at all. <laughs> it's what I say. Um, all right, well, that is the whole tag. If you guys want more videos with him, good, because there's going to be another one for sure. And it's actually going to be um, the Old Wives Tales. Tales? Gender Predictions video. That'll be coming up soon. And that'll go up along with when our gender reveal goes up on the Sim Rally channel. <laughs> That'll be so exciting. So stay tuned on this channel for more of us together. And if you have any other ideas for videos for us to do together, you can tell that Nick loves being in videos. So definitely let me know so he can be in more. Well guys, subscribe if you want to follow my pregnancy and motherhood journey and to learn more about my life. Follow me on social media. All my links are in the description and See, I don't want to say see you guys. You guys will see me and maybe you in the next video.